Hi, my name's Connor and I'm a Bricolay 2018. I'd like to show you my build before we pack up. As we can see here, we're doing the Her Majesty's Theatre and I kind of like the front facade. It's very detailed. And as you can see here, the sign here worked out great, but the vinyl and the lights behind it really stood out great. Now, as we move into the foyer here, there are a couple of uh, key points here. If we look at the top bit here, you can see the lights on the right wall. They are pretty cool because they've got the cheese slope wedge. And also down in here, it's got some cool stair railings. And the actual staircase will be gold instead of tan. And then we can also have some gold bits, see some gold bits here with a couple of pop, pop parts here. Now, a thing that the kids really liked was the Stormtrooper eating a croissant, something that I usually have to, it's my signature. Moving on to the theatre now, we've got 410 many things in the whole layout and we're approximating at around 350 seats in the whole theatre. It's a three-storey thing, and it's got balconies, it's got two-level balconies, and then 15 rows of seats in, down below. Up here we can see we have a light control room where we have a door that can open and close for people to see in and out. It's got lights there so that people can press it and then it changed the colour lights on the stage. And down also here we have our sound box in there. You can see two mini feeds with two computer screens in there. Now if we come to the theatre here, the stage show, we have a generic pirate scene with a little shark guy dancing and a treasure chest in there. If you can look up here, you can see that the lights are blue and yellow. That ties into the light box up there. So now, if we move on to the backstage area here. So we have some loading crates in there with silver vinyl on the edges of the moving crates. That looks really cool as well. And over here, we have the main star's dressing room with a clothes rack, a two desks, a chair and a mirror with lights around it. Now up here we have a green room where the artist can chill out and relax between shows. We have a couple of couches, a table and a fridge and also a desk here. But in the back you can see there's a wall of signatures. In the actual theatre where they're going to renovate it, they're going to move each brick, brick by brick, and then place it in the new green room. If we go up here, we can see that we've got a moving office, so people can work here. And then we've also got a storage facility for all the tools. And now, if you look at the pattern of the floor here, you can see that it's a light grey, gold and dark grey. I thought that this effect was really cool. It looks really nice as well. And over here in the main dressing room, we also have it in, we also have these things in black. If we move on to here now, and if we come around the back, we can have a look and see that this whole wall would hinge in there because it's got hinges in here now we have the back wall but also we have a space so that people can see inside the theater showing up lights here the main spotlights right there and all the seats now if we come around here we have the new foyer section, which is which is going to be upgraded. Here we have a glass chat, a glass wall that goes from the bottom to the top of the build, from this height down to this height, and 
we have four floors in here, including on the bottom floor, a mezzanine floor. Now, the thing that I really like is the sort of yellowish lights in there. They are globes, and then we've stuck clear mini fig heads in them. I thought that looked cool as well. And now, for a couple of other things, in here we have some screens in here that can change so it'll cycle through all the different shows and we've got two here one for each side so this is my ambulance it's got flashing blinker lights here it's got the top lights here and then it also has the back lights here I open up the top here we can see we have the UCS Innovations board here and we've bought it off Darwood and if you go to the website then you can get lights from him you can get flashing lights for your Lego builds and and we've also got a little I have to turn it on we also have a little board from him stuck beneath stuck behind uh, my name badge here and that flashes and lights up so as that's well very cool isn't it yeah and this is and speaking about the brick badge this is a brick badge of all the lego shows i have been to and exhibited at okay so everyone should get one of those flashing name badge lights from david from ucs technology yeah the, yep. very cool awesome all right uh, what else have you got to show um who have you got on the balcony then on the balcony here we have Dame Edna, he is the patron of the theatre. Well, Barry Humphreys is yeah, the patron of the theatre. Barry yeah. Humphreys is the patron of the theatre. And on the limo we have a gold frog hood ornament, which I thought was pretty cute. Let's get in close there so I can see that. Yep. Am I seeing that? Yep. Yeah, there I am there, there he is. Alright, is that about everything you want to show us? Yeah. This is Connor from Bricolay 2018 and thank you for watching.